In 2008, New York Times correspondent David Rode was doing final research for a book about Afghanistan when he was kidnapped by the Taliban. He was held in various parts of Afghanistan and Pakistan for seven months before escaping. Back home, his wife of just two months, Kristen Mulvihill, was thrown into a brand new world. Instead of starting a new home and a new life, she had months of hostage negotiations. When we crossed into Pakistan, when we were taken to the tribal areas of Pakistan, this is the area where Al-Qaeda and Osama bin Laden are thought to be hiding, I thought we were doomed. I thought we'd be held for years or killed. kept you going to such a degree that you actually found the will, really the courage to escape. It did, and it, it sort of centered me every day. And in the end, we decided to escape because they were just playing games with these negotiations, and we felt we would, we would never be released. Um, I was furious at our captors, and I really wanted them to get nothing for us. 